So I'm on a quest to find some of the best car wrappers in the UK. So when you guys spend your hard earned money, you know what to look for, where to look for it, and you don't end up with a wrap job from hell. They left a really bad review. That resulted in them keying the entire car. So on today's video, I met Levi from Wrexham in North Wales. And his quality and attention to detail is something I haven't seen outside of Yanomai's for a very long time. Wow, that's a proper job, mate. And for someone who wraps vans for a living... Chevrons, Tex, EWID buzzes, Sprinter vans, every van possible, I basically have to wrap. He was very confident. You can stand there with your big chest. If you don't want me to wrap your car, I'm not here for a quote. He said the magic words. Yanni, rate my rap. So I'm gonna have to look over his car with even more of a critical eye than usual. So it's a nice orange BMW. Wow, look at the carbon. Obviously that's nothing to do with the wrap. <laughs> okay then. Okay then, he did tell me the car was wrapped about eight months ago. So obviously stone chips and things like that are gonna be acceptable. I'm gonna give this a little bit more attention just based on the fact that he is a professional rapper. I'm the owner of LC Wraps. So I've been rapping for eight years now. This is my BMW M4 that I wrapped myself. It's the best wrap I've done. However, the pink was better in other ways. Okay, nice finishing, nice, nice. Oh, perfect all the way around. Okay, edges all right. Could this be the first ever panel we don't actually put a tape on? He's gone in. So look, there's the original color of his car. He's wrapped all the way inside, even on the wing, he's come all the way in. Not many people do that. They stop short. So he's made sure that no matter what panel is closed on the car, you can't see any of the maroon. My car's my life. It's like, if I'm pissed off, I wrap. If that doesn't work, I go out with my car. Mate, it's good. It's good, it's nice to look at this. I might not need that much tape. His edges just let him down slightly, but they're not, they're not huge errors. They're not, they're not major. They're just little imperfections. There's nothing underneath the light, which means this full bumper came off. Uh, yeah, fully stripped the car myself. I took off the front bumper. It's just the trickiest part on the car. I'm not gonna mark him down for putting the joins because the joins are very, very good. He has got a real big stretch there that shows on the vinyl, so I've got to put one there. Sometimes you do have to put a joint if you can't get it done in one piece. So there's no bubbles, there's no lift. Right, he's been consistent where he's put the joints on that side, the same on this side, which is really, really important, but nothing lifting, no lift anywhere. Three on a front bumper, that's really good. That's really good. A lot of rappers these days think vinyl sticks to anything when it doesn't, it does need a bit of heat. People don't use temp guns on that, so if they're not post heating to 100 degrees, over time it will fail. Use a temp gun, knifeless tape, save cutting on, on the paintwork and that, and it should be pretty fine. Oh, hello, hello, shuts and returns, yeah? The biggest exposure for any rapper is shuts and returns. People struggle with doing the shuts and returns. See, the fact that I wrapped so far in the door shuts, I got so far with them, but I didn't actually take the doors off because I'm not really confident in taking the doors off by himself. So obviously he's proper stripped this car down. You can see everything's come off this car. He's done a proper strip job. Yeah, you can't, you've got to take the doors off. So like doors have come off, doors, wing mirrors, bumpers. He went to town on this. Wow, no, no, nothing. God, and Levi, done the inside as well. That's a proper job, mate. No lift. You're trying to do the shuts and you've got the door there. It's a lot harder to get the vinyl across. And with this orange, it does this color like quite easy. I'm gonna mark him so you can see the color, the color change on the vinyl. Can you see that where it goes to yellow? So I'm gonna have to put something there. There's other things that I might have done differently if I had more time, like the shuts. Normally I'd do the rear quarter completely in one piece. However, I've actually infilled the rear quarter this time. See, look, you've done the full petrol cap. A lot of people in the past you've seen, they've done the petrol cap and they only do like the little bit here. Oh, this is good, this is good. I'll be honest, this is like looking at a similar Yanomai's wrap where you only put a few tapes on the car. When you do a Nico Mark, one to three, maybe. And then my other guys, maybe a three to five, but five is like the maximum you can put on any car. You should never be putting any more than that. I don't really promote my business, if I'm totally honest. I have like a small little client base that do keep me going all year round. However, when I do go car shows and that, I do get people ask me how much to wrap a car. He's done inside the boo, okay. But when a customer gets their car wrapped, you do shuts and returns, you don't do the bonnet and you don't do the boot. He's gone all the way in, all the way round. So I have to applaud that, fair play. He's, he's gone extreme on this. See that there? Theoretically, should have cut that out. Sometimes you have places where the water needs to drip out. You've got a gap there. That's not correct. You've got a little bit there, a little bit of orange sticking up. A lot of people don't do that. He's done that. 
A lot of people just leave that because they think, oh, it just slides in. It's nice, he's done that. I'm really, really impressed. This is a good wrap. <laughs> this is a good wrap. How good do you think your job is? Uh, Don't look at the tapes, but how good do you think your job is? I, w I would say it's pretty good. How long have you been rapping? Uh, about eight years now. Eight years, so you're experienced? Yeah, yeah I'm experienced. Okay, so let's go to the front of the car. Yeah. That's a really good bonnet. From when I opened it, I looked at all the lines inside. Really, really good. Yeah. But if I'm being really, really extra, you know on the edges? Yeah. Really here. It's very, very small, very, very difficult to come over fully. Okay, here and there, do you see? Yeah, yeah. What happens is it seems that when this is overstretched, it goes yellow. Yeah. So I've seen that on a couple of places. It's not the end of the world. And to give you some props, there's not one panel I'd remove off this car. Well, that's and I've never said that to anyone. That's good to hear. Not one panel. Where I think you struggle a little bit, you know when you do your joins, you make them really wide. Yeah. Why? Probably because I do commercial wrapping, we have bigger joins. Correct. So while you do your car wrapping, you'll do like a knifeless tape thing, whereas I always go that little bit more. Based on vans, I understand why you've got your joins. They're, yeah. they're a lot wider. I think when you're doing cars, they have to be smaller because they are they are really, really thick. You've mirrored both sides. So where one side has got quite a big joint, the other side exactly the same. And that's really important to me. Where I was trained, everything had to be mirrored. So if there was 10 vans in a line, if there was, say there was a leaf on yeah. one wing and it was slightly onto the door, that was not good enough. The leaf needed to be in the same place. There you go. So I've always been anal with like joints and that. So yeah, that, yeah. Is, that is something. But your attention to detail is really on point. If you look, there's no tapes anywhere around your doors. I can't see no bubbles, I can't see no lifts. You've obviously removed the doors. No. You've done. You didn't remove the door? No. You didn't remove the door, so you managed to get in. How long did that take you to do then? Because if you'd removed the door, it'd taken you, you'd have done it a lot quicker. I had a bit of patience when I was doing that. But... Okay, why did you not take the door off? Uh, basically, the one friend I would allow to strip my doors of me, yeah. he broke his leg. I didn't want to take my doors off Fine. if I didn't have to. Okay. And the reason I've went so far on this one yeah. is because it was when I first wrapped it pink, I did just finish it there. Okay. But then somebody went in my car and was like, oh, well, I can see it. And it pissed me off. So yeah. I thought, you know what? I'll see how far I can go without taking the doors off. That's really good. I, I did have a bit of patience there. That's really know. impressive because to me, that door come off. I thought that door would come off because usually when we wrap these cars, the only thing that gives away is the hinges. Yeah. And the fact that this car is burgundy, like a maroon color, I looked to see where I could find any maroon, any burgundy. I couldn't find it anywhere except for places where you expect to see it. Yeah, yeah. Like, like on a hinge, like underneath the bonnet, like in the engine bay. You understand? Yeah, yeah. Can I ask that join there where you'd prefer? Because oh, I see... did that in one piece. Yeah, do you so... see why I put that there? Yeah, I seen it. No, so what I did was, it wasn't the join. Ah. Why didn't you cut the hole? Oh, I don't know, to be fair, no. I don't actually know, to be fair. <laughs> oh, do you think it was the join? Yeah, I was, I was just like interested because yeah. I was like, I knew I'd done that in like, like one piece. And I, no, it's good. I, I fighted with it, I'll be honest. No, it's good. It's just that you didn't cut that out. That's all it was. Yeah. Uh, when you come around here, this trim obviously wasn't fitted properly. I, I seen you on the camera. I was like, I know exactly what that was. <laughs> My guys, not all of them, but can wrap a rear quarter in one piece all the way in. Again, I have done that when it was pink. Okay. This time, when it was orange, as you've seen on the bumper, it does discolour very quick. Yeah, you can't yeah, do it, you it, can't do one piece with the door on. I, I did when it was pink. I'll be honest. With the door on again. When, yeah, when it was pink, I had this thing where I, it was the first time I wrapped it, so it had to be perfect. Okay. So when I wrapped it pink, all that was all in one piece with the doors on. You can't see any maroon anywhere. You can't see any purple anywhere or whatever. What colour is this? Maroon? You want to call it uh, maroon? Sakira orange. No, no, not the orange. The, the not original colour. No, the original colour. Sakira orange. It is. It can't be, mate. It's a Kia orange. Mate. That's the colour of it. Look, 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 look at this. Look at this. Look Trust at this. Me. Look at this. Look at this. That, that's the name of the car. Don't tell me. It's a Kia orange. <laughs> look at the, Does that look orange to you? That is not orange. That is maroon. That is red. That is burgundy. That is not orange. That's orange. Tell BMW. <laughs> Honestly, it's a Kia yeah, the orange. Same, the same way when, when they say it's a black car and it looks blue. You know, um, is it carbon black? Carbon black <laughs> edition and it looks blue. That's, anyway, that's, that's not orange. <laughs> um, but even like you've come in, even on your wing, you've come right in. Yeah. What have you done that based on? Have you seen other rappers? Have you seen videos? Because that's something that you, you have to be taught and you have to learn. I enjoy what I do. So when I did my first car wrap, I did shuts and returns. So then when you upgrade your car, you're then not going to not do shuts and returns. And then when you enjoy it, you sort of get lost in the moment. You're like, oh, well, will vinyl go down there? Will it not? I was walking and I was smiling. I'm like, this is really good. This is really good. <laughs> and I'm not used to saying it because I'm like, this is terrible. That's rubbish. What has he done here? Oh my God. And I just went, 
extra. I went above and below, like even here, like this, it's just here, there. All it is, it's the, the, it's the bump and the wing rubbing. Yeah. That's it, that just happens with movement. It's not, I said, you ain't done nothing wrong. But I'm just having to find something because... Got to use a tape up somewhere. Yeah, I've got to use a tape <laughs> but usually I use the whole tape for the whole car. So this here, I love this. Talk to me a little bit about this if you don't mind. I do suffer a bit of like mental health every now and again. Everybody has their wobbles. My car is something that gets me through it. So it's like, if I'm feeling shit, I'll go rapping. If rapping doesn't work that day, I'll just go out in the car and drive. When you put it on there, people come up to you and they'll actually like speak to you about it. You might be chatting for like 20 minutes and it's just like, that person will feel better. And obviously me just saying it, I feel better, so. The world we live in is very, very difficult. And for people to be able to talk about it, people say men don't talk and stuff like that. So that's, that's really cool. So listen, I commend you on that, man. I commend you on that. Well done, man. Well done, fair play to you, man. All right, it's business time. The score for Levi's BMW wrapped in orange is there was no. Eight. I'll level up. That's a good score. Yeah. That's the highest score we've Appreciate had. Appreciate that. It's an eight. And trust me, that is a top of top score. I'm brutal. If you lived in London, you would get hired because that's how good the quality of this wrap is. And the fact that I can say to you, I wouldn't remove any panel, says how good you are, pal. Levi scores an eight, taking him to first place above Lauren. Guys, if you're looking to improve your rapping skills, we have teamed up with our friends Avery Dennison exclusively for Rate My Rap. They're offering a 10% discount on all their training courses, which is being launched on their brand new platform, AD Rap Center. Here you can learn PPF, color change, digital print, and window tinting, as well as booking training courses and connecting with Avery Dennison experts. Click the link in the description and use the code Yanni at checkout to claim your discount today. I can see you've got the mind for it and you should be proud, man. Honestly, I, I feel really good to say it to you because you are a rapper. Where do you live? Wrexham, North Wales. Wrexham, so if you're in that area, trust me, you could take your car to this man and you won't have any issues, he, he's that good. If a customer came to you and said, wrap this car, shut and returned with the boot and everything you've done, what would you charge the customer? If it was to this level and I, they were genuine and they actually wanted it wrapped, I'd probably say around £4,000. £4,000, really? Yeah. Okay, so I estimated this job around £2,800. Yeah. In fact, you know what, I did forget that obviously he did do inside the boot lid, so yeah, I'd have probably gone over 3000 But it is really good. And also, I'm London, you're Wrexham. Yeah. So obviously people, people charge different prices. The thing is, so I don't need to do the car wraps because I do the commercial. Yeah. So. If you want your car wrapped and you want me to wrap your car, I will wrap your car. It's a if you don't want me to wrap your car, I'm not here for a quote. Oh, you see that? You see, that's confidence there. That's no, it, confidence. It, it, and there's nothing to, no, but there's nothing wrong with confidence. To me, you've got to be that person. And let me say something to you. You can't be confident if this was rubbish. Based on the fact that this was really good, you can stand there with your big chest and say, you know what, I'm good. And Yanni said, I'm good. <laughs> so that says it all. <laughs> well done. Appreciate it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you to Levi for coming down and bringing us his car. He scored an eight, and I'll see you on the next Rate My Rap. See you later. Next time on Rate My Rap. I went on a rapping course. He's wrapped the car, and then he's looked around, he's like, oh, I've got a big black bit there. You know what, let me just stick a stick here. Oh, I've got a big black bit. Let me just put a plaster here. I've got another bit here. Let me just put a plaster here. Yeah.